We are Princeton Intermediate, home of Tiger Pride, where we respect ourselves, others, property, and community. Good morning, Princeton Intermediate. This is Tiger Pride News. I'm Lily. And I'm McKenna. Today is Wednesday, October 26, 2022, Rotation 2. Riddle of the day, what's big, scary, and has three wheels? Big, scary, and three wheels. I don't know. It's a monster a, on a tricycle. A monster, which is scary, three wheels, tricycle. I get it. Try, three, tricycle. Got, got it. Okay. Uh, Tiger Pride tip of the day. It's actually Wednesday. Uh, but the tip of the day today is all about um, listening to more staff and students talk about different jobs around the school. And today it's classroom teachers. Now, most of you have, well, you all have a classroom teacher, right? Most of you have an idea what that's all about. We'll hear from students and then a few classroom teachers regarding what they do, see how they compare. Hope you enjoy this video. We interviewed these students to see what they think staff do around school. What do you think teachers do? Just teach kids and just help them and stuff. I'll help with math and reading. She teaches us and we do fun activities. Teach. The teachers, they help you learn stuff like fractions, division. They help you learn stuff that you don't know. They teach um, students. Teach. Teachers teach kids so they can read and learn. They teach kids what like stuff like that they have to learn and teachers they teach the students and they make sure that like nobody gets hurt and stuff yeah. for the lockdown um they teach children a lot of good stuff because children need to be teached how to do stuff they help you learn they help kids learn they help kids learn, and they teach them new stuff, even though if they already know it, and they teach them stuff that they don't know. Teach us math and all the other subjects. They do things and help you get smarter. They teach. They teach us. And the teachers have, um, they, they teach, they teach, the kids how to learn. Um, they teach us the things we need to learn. Um, they teach you um, how to do stuff. I think they're fun and I think they um, do their job. Um, te teach you stuff that you need to learn. Um, help the students uh, learn. They teach kids every day. They teach other kids like me and other kids like my best friends and all that. They help us learn. What is your job at the intermediate school? Well, my name is Virginia Hernandez. I'm Spanish and I came here to teach Spanish in Princeton Public School. I'm so happy and being, um, being very glad to be here. Um, my days always start for greeting my students, telling them how they are, and taking a moment to check on everyone. And then we did together the little planning about the day, letting them know what is going to be or what uh, the things that are new for today. All right, so my name is Mrs. Nybor, and I'm a fifth grade teacher here at Princeton Intermediate School. Um, this is my 15th year working in this district, um, and I have stayed primarily in fourth and fifth grade. Um, I wake up super early every morning, and I get myself and my kids to school, and I try to be here by 7 so that I can um, get everything ready for the day and get the smart board ready and all of my books open and prepared. Um, and then I look at my lesson plan and make sure I remember everything I'm doing for the day. Uh, and then we, we go through our daily schedule. Um, and then while I'm doing that, my brain is always rolling through all the other things that are coming up next or the things I have to remember. And I have to answer emails and make sure that everyone's doing all right, check in with everyone. I like to make sure that my kids are, 
are feeling all right in the classroom and smiling whenever possible. Um, and so we go through our day, um, lunch specialist keeping track of all of that when kids are leaving and coming and going. And then after school, after I say goodbye to all the kids, I meet with my team and we spend another hour and a half planning to make sure that we are ready for the upcoming week. Um, we do all sorts of uh, games and lesson planning for math and reading and then we have to coordinate science and social studies and, and we make sure that we are attending the meetings that we need to attend. So my day is really, really busy and I don't normally leave here until 3.30 or 4 at night. And then even when I'm at home, sometimes I do things at home too. So being a fifth grade teacher is very busy. My name is Miss Ryan and I teach fourth grade. Um, my job responsibilities include um, planning lessons, grading papers, um, building relationships with my students, making sure that they build relationships with each other, and um, communicating with parents. So typically sending out a weekly message or two of just what's going on in the classroom. And then also just um, in emailing individual parents, um, just answering questions that they have or communicating about their child's, um, what they're doing, their growth um, behaviors. And also, um, aside from just teaching, we also have meetings. So attending staff meetings and PLC meetings. And um, another job I do here at school is that I'm a teacher coach. So I get to go around and um, watch other teachers do their magic in the classroom and then we just talk about the lesson and it's fun to just see um, all the different ideas of what teachers do here around Princeton Intermediate. Uh, hey, I'm Mr. Rashavi. I teach third grade. Part of my job as teaching is to prepare lessons um, based off of state standards that uh, the state of Minnesota gives me and I kind of got to match those up to make sure I'm teaching you what is required. Uh, so I spend a lot of time preparing those kind of behind the scene things would be setting up uh, all of the little tech pieces, whether that's in Seesaw or assigning on Excel categories. Um, a lot of that stuff that I do over my prep that when you guys get on your Chromebook, it's just ready to go. Uh, so uh, it's a lot of planning kind of behind the scenes stuff like that. So I can actually then teach the lesson. So, I mean, the majority of the day is working with you guys, the kids. Uh, so that is teaching, reading, math, science. Uh, we also teach SEL. I like to tell stories. If you've been in my class, we do uh, Friday Life lessons and videos as well and maybe get in a little bit of silent balls. So that is kind of my day. Hope you enjoyed that video on um, classroom teachers. And just a reminder, we're looking at how we can respect all staff around the school. Good news shout out for Miss Valeria Stabella. Bella is an outstanding example of a student who goes above and beyond when showing Tiger Pride. Bella is a role model student and always does her very best. Keep up the great work, Bella. Good news shout out for Miss Densley to the following students who are working really hard, staying focused, trying their best, and never giving up during the first day of pickleball in PE class. Austin Fountain, Caitlin Crick, Caden Golden, Chloe Hegberg, Logan Balzer, Amanda Lind, Brandon Holman, Arlo Merton, Erie Stuckey, Avery Schmitz, Chase Gain, Eleanor Wigowski. Birthdays for today, Savannah Hammond, Griffin Mackey. Lunch for today. Chicken oda soup with jam or sandwich or cheese sandwich, pasta salad, chocolate chip cookie, raw veggies, fruit, milk. Menu changes may be due, may be made due to the availability. Please, Please stand, stand for the Pledge of Allegiance, right hand, hand over your heart. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Show your tiger pride today!